Hello 2B4, this is Mr. Lee's doing your homework on profit and loss that's due quite soon. So let's have a wee look. So profit is where you make more money than you spent on your item and you lose money if you sell something for less than what you paid for it, okay? So let's have a look at it. Karen bakes a cake, the ingredients cost her £8, so she spent £8. She sells the cake for 15 so she's made more money than she paid for it, so she's made a profit. How much of a profit? 15 to 8. Hopefully you can do that in your head. She's made a £7 profit. So let's look at 2. Peter buys a skateboard. It cost £18. He sells it for £30. So he's sold it for more than he paid. So he's made a profit. And what's 30 Take away 18 Again, that's one you could probably do in your head. He's made a £12 profit. Richard buys a vase in an auction, he cost them 23 and he sells it for 39 so he's made a profit. And what is 39? Take away 23. So let's just do that one there. Let's have a look. 39 take 23. 9 take 3 is 6. 3 take 2 is 1. So he's made a £16 profit. Number 4, Laura makes a quilt. The material cost her 25 She sold it for 55 so she's made a profit. And 55, take away 25, again, that's one you can probably do in your head, okay? But if you can't, there it is there, or if you might struggle, there it is there. 5 take 5 is nothing, 5 take 2 is 3, so it's £30 profit for the quilt. Number 5. Donna buys a motorbike for £800, she sells it for 720 So this is the first one, I think, where there's a loss, so she's lost some money. Could because that's less than that. How much of a loss? So what is 800 take away 720? So let's just pop that back there. So there we have 800 take away 720. And you'll notice I've already done this. So as I don't make mistakes. Nothing take nothing is nothing. Nothing take two you can't do. So we take one off the eight and we call that seven. And that one goes there. And you look at this like it's ten. So ten take away two is eight. And 7 takes 7 is nothing, so the answer is £80. So she's made an £80 loss on the motorbike. Gary spends £450 on a painting. He sold it for 480 so he's made a profit. And 480 take away 450 is £30. So he's made a £30 profit on the painting. Number 7. Kim spent £80 on trousers for a wedding. She sold them online for 65 So she's made a loss because that's less than that. And what's 80 take away 65 Well, again, maybe you can just do that in your head, but here we go. So 80 take away 65 Nothing take 5 you can't do. So we take 1 off the 8, call it 7, call that 10. 10 take 5 is 5 and 7 take 6 is 1. So a £15 loss there for number seven on the trousers. Number eight, Colin paid £25 for a book and sold it for £6. So he's made quite a, a loss on that. So he's made a loss. And what's the difference between 25 and 6? So there we have it again. 25 take 6. So there it is written there. Now 5 take 6 you can't do. So we'll take one off the 2 and we'll call that 1. And that one goes there. So 15 take 6 is 9. And 1 take nothing there. So 1 take nothing is 1. So that made he's made a £19 loss on the book. Number 9. Bob received £43 for a games console he bought for 22 So the wording's just to maybe not catch out, but a wee bit different. So he paid £22 for it, but he got £43 when he sold it okay so he's actually made a profit and what's the difference between 43 and 22 so let's look at number nine so 43 take 22 again no problem with this one because three take two is one and four take two is two so 21 pound profit for for bob there number 10 jane got 250 pound for a chest of drawers that she paid 340 pound for. So she paid £340, she got that when she sold it, so she's made a loss. Okay, and what's the difference between 340 and 250 So again, there's a sum there. So 340 take away 250 Nothing take nothing, it's nothing. 
4 take 5, can't do. So we take 1 off the 3 and we call that 2 and that's 14. So 14 take 5 is 9 and 2 take 2 is nothing. So she's made a £90 loss. Okay. Number 11. Sally paid £400 for an old car and spent £300 restoring it. And then she sold the newly restored car for £900. So if she spent £400 on the car and £300 doing it up, she spent a total of £700 on the car. And if she sold it for £900, I'll just move that a little bit, yeah, so she's made a profit. A 900 takes 700, I'm sure that's one you can do in your head. She's made a £200 profit on her car. Number 12, Paul spent £85 on new clothes plus £10 for delivery and he sold them for £90. Well, how much did he spend altogether? Well, he spent £85 on the clothes, £10 on delivery. So he spent £95 in total altogether. And if he sold the clothes for £90, he's made a loss because that's less than that. How much? Just a £5 loss. So that's that one done there. So hopefully you found that useful.